Hello everybody, this is the Bulldozer, and thank you for watching one of my videos. This week's calling card for the Blackjack is Prowler. This is week Stop. five of the six week calling card series. And our two contracts are Total Victory and aspect. Aggressive. Total of Victory, you need to win 20 games, period. Aggressive, kill 100 attackers or defenders in an objective game type, like Domination for instance. You see, I still have time there on, on the screen from last week's calling card. I didn't want to waste that. I'm going to use that time to help me work on this week's calling card. Okay, domination is the way we're going to want to go here. I'm going to be running the ICR with the thermal, two smokes, overclock, ghost, cold-blooded, and dead silence. But I want to drop that overclock here in a few games. I'm going to be putting on another attachment on the ICR as well as the trophy system. And you're really going to see how that's really going to help out. It makes things a lot easier. Let's get in, into these clips. Sentry in your AO. I need two more kills here. See, these two guys tried to take B, and we put a I put a stop to that, I should say. Gives me the aggressive. Now I'm going to go ahead and show you a couple clips on the reason why I like to use smoke for a defense and an offense type situations. Here's a little tip for you. If you see somebody's dashboard in the game, nine times out of ten that game is going to end. You see that, e that little Ethernet plug hump on your screen. You need to dashboard your game if you want to save any kills, especially if you're having a good game and you're working on a contract like, like aggressive and you need all those those points. As you can see here, I was in the I was in the low to mid mid seventies and I got got all my points that I earned for that game. Because of the fact that I dashboarded my game when I saw that. By you dashboarding your game, you save all your kills and everything. I don't know if you get hit with the win or loss, but if somebody else dashboards the game, and because the game is getting ready to end, and you do nothing, you lose everything. Everything that you just did was for nothing. Just a little tip. Enemy to B. Okay, here we are. I'm going to make my way back to B. And I'm going to throw my smoke down. See, the smoke, especially right here, it makes it hard to, for them to see you because of that wall. Go here, get here by the crate because you want to kill them either trying to take the location or, or kill them while you're taking the location. And both of those kills, types of kills, will go towards your, your contract. And see, I'm going to throw smoke down so they can't see anything. Look, yeah, I'm going to pick up the kill there. And, losing A. you know, it really just, it really frustrates the hell out of me. Friendly and you can see, UAV I'm having a really good game. Got four captures, 13 defense. We lost alpha. I'm having a really good game. Yeah, I got more inbound. defense than anybody else on my team. And... We're still having these problems, and it's securing alpha. Not new problems. That is what is so bad, so bad about this. You know, Treyarch. They keep fixing all this other stuff. You need to fix the main stuff. Now, now I'm just getting kicked. Now, at first I thought, okay, well, something might happen to me or whatever. But that wasn't the case. Once I got back into the game, first thing I did was hit Y and go search it, and people that was in my game is still at the main lobby. So that means everybody got kicked. Everybody got disconnected. And in the middle of a good game, you know, so everything everybody did there, you see there, been disconnected from the Call of Duty Black Ops servers. So, so everything everybody did in that game, they lost. It was all for nothing. Now I'm gonna try to get online, and it's gonna take forever to get online. And you know, I have a video put together and everything, and I'm gonna have to add this to that video and redo the audio for it or add audio onto it because it's just absolutely insane. We should not be having these problems, and it is affecting our game type. Our, our game vigorously and if it's not that it's the 
It's the idiots coming into your game, team killing you, just so they can get kicked. And Treyarch don't give a damn about that either because they're more of a core uh, player. You see that every year. You see that with every Call of Duty. There's a lot more games for core than there is for hardcore. They 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 can care less about the hardcore players. At least that that's how they make it feel. See, that's how I can tell you right now. The same damn air you can YouTube this air code on YouTube, and you'll find. Okay, now look. Here's just one video I went and did a screenshot of of a YouTube channel, and he's got a similar code that I have, and even he's got WTF. It's like you know, it just makes no sense. And this video that has been uploaded to YouTube is dated. December 15th. December 15th. We're almost, what, seven months from that date? We're two days shy of being seven months from that date. And these type of errors are still happening. And it's absolutely ridiculous. It just goes to show that they do not fix the things they need to fix. And again, it's the reason why Battlefield's going to stomp Call of Duty and Call of Duty franchise might be over with. And I think they know that. That's the reason why they're releasing this comic book series, Call of Duty Zombies. And there's a rumor, has it, that says that, you know, there might actually be a game itself of all the Call of Duty Zombie maps. So, yeah, I think they know they are in some serious trouble. All this started when they decided to go to three different developers. And it kicked them in the rear end because that was a stupid, stupid thing for them to do. But it just, you know, Call of Duty and Activision, or actually Activision and Treyarch, they need to listen to their players. And if you're going to ignore your players, you're just going to fall in line with a lot of these other big time games that have crashed because they refuse to. Look at this. I got one kill. That was the first game they put me into where literally I got one kill and the game was over. They put me in the, in the, at the end of a game and I didn't even get the damn win. At least the loss didn't count against my stats. Whoopie doo. So everything I did there, you saw I had 18 kills. You seen I had 13 defends. So there should be at least 14 defends there. Not counting the other ones that's not calculated on the scoreboard. It's just absolutely insane. There's no reason for this whatsoever. You know, so, so everything I just did was for nothing. It was a waste of time. I mean, come on, Treyarch, fix your game. But sorry for the rambling, sorry for the rant. Let's get back to this uh, week five calling card. Here's another tactic that I like to use. I'll stay back in this room and I'll throw smoke. But there's already smoke out there, so you can... Really easy, and every one of those kills, even though the theater mode is not showing it, it goes against, it goes towards my counter. See, neither one of these guys can see me here. I gotta change my sensitivity. Hostile care package overhead. Video, I can tell that. Here's another clip. You see, because I'm laying on B, you know, that counts towards my towards my contract. Pretty easy. And you can see I finished off my contracts. Got the blackjack unlocked also. Not too bad. 18 to 15. I'll take that. There's all my contracts that are done. Now let's go unlock the mercenary contract. Take a look at the back of the card. There's our prowler calling card that we're going for. 
and I actually get this in the very first game. Very first game I go into, I'm able able to get this. Which, you know, I've got a video on YouTube talking about Gambler. If you're not aware of it, Gambler is the way to go. You check that out. I gotta get now. one more kill using a specialist. And I got a glitch. Another over here somewhere. I see him glitch back. And that will finish the side bet. That is my four kills with that th actually three different specialists in that game. There's my rewards. Also went up another level from a prestige master. 26 and 14 that game, not too bad. Level 249 prestige master. I'll take it. Shows all the contracts are done. Even the daily. See the lock's gone now because the side bed is completed. Now let's go take and put on the calling card. Actually might help if I hit the right buttons. There we go. I don't know why that still said new. But there we go, there is Pryler. Got one more to go. Next week's contracts, when you complete those, you actually get two calling cards because you will complete this set. Rainbow Trip is next week's calling card. And then the classified calling card is Groovy Rider. And that's the animated calling card. I kind of say it looks like... Um, Ghost Rider. I don't know if it's meant to be like that or not, but that's why I say it looks like. Okay, that will do it for this video. Again, sorry for the rant, just I'm getting really fed up with all of the issues we are having. And I know Call of Duty better get their act together because Battlefield's going to stomp them in the ground. Stuff like this keeps going on because Affinity Ward is a hated game ain't even here yet speaking of that i have that contest going on the video will be at the end so if you like this video please hit it with a like i appreciate it this is the bulldozer and i'm out of here i hope you enjoyed the video you just watched here's some more videos you might be interested in at the top of the page is the call of duty black ops 3 contract calling cards I have all these calling cards in one playlist for you. So if you're interested in seeing these videos, click on the wood plaque that says contract calling cards and it'll take you to that playlist. The bottom left hand corner of the page is the giveaway video. If you're going to subscribe to my channel, you must watch that video first because I have a giveaway going on and I do not want you to miss out on the giveaway because you need to use the Glim link to subscribe to, subscribe to the channel. On the right hand side of the video you see my jerk series. Jerk you're out of here. As for people that likes a little extra attention in Call of Duty and want to go around and team kill their their teammates. Both videos are great videos and I'm sure the one on the right hand side you will like especially this one because two guys decide to think they would be idiots and I had the last laugh as I mark on the videos. Thanks again for watching. See you on the next one.